Well, hello again, friends. It's Rick here. I just closed this door. I uh, spent the day. Remember, I don't know if you remember this door here, always uh, flapping about in the wind. So I had a, an old door hanger there available, and I thought, why not use it for a sideways anchorage? See? Works great. But I'll just close it because. sunlight even look a little bit of sunlight coming through behind me just messes up the, uh, the filming wow look at all it coming up through the back let me see maybe it's the lens maybe I need to get the better quality lenses for this yeah yeah maybe it was a dirty lens that's why it was so shiny anyway look at all the metal on the floor <laughs> maybe i should weigh that instead apart from all the stuff that stuck to my clothes and i carried away so yeah um just thought i'd show you the progress um on the crank i've actually where's my chair who stole my chair I was actually uh, quite a few people told me oh you're destroying your your crankshaft you don't know what you're doing you're gonna hurt yourself um, how are you how you're gonna keep the crank balanced and everybody's very concerned which is good in a way but you know maybe if they watched more of my channel they would know that my plan is to after I've done this work to uh, well yes to have it rebalanced everything is going to get balanced right it's not just the crank that's going to get balanced the rods are going to get balanced the rods and the pistons the flywheel the, the, the clutch everything will get balanced because I want that instant reply to the throttle I want that room room if it's out of balance it will vibrate it will not do that right so I think I'm about halfway through on this project now um, to about how far I want to get and then I will take it I will take it down to applied engineering and um, ask them if they if I should do more or, or just leave it what I've done or I should do a bit more I mean some people will write even knife edge the entire counterweight right and they'll cut all this corner of here and I'll knife edge all of this they'll knife edge everything this all the way down and they'll probably take away 20 percent maybe 25 percent of the weight of the crankshaft but yeah I don't plan to do that so what I'm going to do now is finish it on on this clip and um do a bit of a b-roll on it and show you what it looks like when I'm done before I take it down to applied engineering if they say it's fine I'll leave it there when the for when the pistons and rods get here or they may say hang on to it till the pistons and rods because the the journals were fine as I expected the journals were fine they don't need grinding it just needs a good polish so um, and then balancing See, if you don't know anything, these are balancing holes. They are holes drilled by the factory to balance the crank originally. That's the original balancing holes. There's one, there's one, right. there's one. 
and that will be done again see this is the rough cut and these are a bit a little bit tidied right so so the reason for this is it spins clockwise just so people understand why because a lot of people don't understand why I'm doing this right firstly it makes the crank lighter guys it makes it lighter a lighter crank or a lighter internals means better throttle response okay and this believe it or not at 8000 rpm spins like this 8,000 times per minute. Now, have you ever stuck your window out of a moving car? Um, even just at low speed, you feel force. Just like these faces, surfaces, as it spins clockwise, right? These have resistance in the inside and pick up air and and oil that is just below the crank it'll pick up air and it will suck up oil and throw it around the base the bottom of the engine and it, that becomes like the air will become thick and the thicker it gets the harder it is for the crank to turn so the more you can streamline a crank the easier it will spin inside the engine i hope that's understandable now I've always wanted to do this. I've never done it. This is my first go. So I hope you're enjoying it like I am. Anyway, I'm going to continue now um, just cutting and grinding. So you've already seen me do that. No need to see more. And I'll show you when I'm done.